Well, Dr. Malcolm, here to share a few campfire stories with my uncle. I was there, I know what happened, and so do you. Injun is my responsibility now, Doctor, and I will jealously defend its interests. You were right and I was wrong there. Did you ever expect to hear me say such a thing? Isla Nubla was just a showroom, something for the tourists. Site B was the factory floor. That was on Ina Sauna. A few weeks ago, a British family on a yacht cruise stumbled across the island. The boarders used the incident to take control of Injun from me. Okay, so there's another island with dinosaurs, no fences this time, and you want to send people in? I need a complete photo record of those animals. You didn't contact Sarah. She'll be fine. And believe me, the research team was not a research expedition anymore. It's a rescue operation, and it's leaving right now. You can't shave three days off my deadline. Expect everything to be ready. I'm not fully supplied. I haven't field tested any of this stuff. All right, people, we're going nowhere until we get these vehicles fixed up. I need half air on the tires here, guys. All right. So, you think you're up to attaching the wheels, Carlo? Yeah. I'm not completely useless. Chloe! I got a splinter! From rubber? Just get in the car. Oh, a wrench! I say, I used a mallet. See, that explains it. Hey, hey, hey! She's purring like a kitten! A really, really loud kitten! <laughs> oh, thanks. What has gotten stuck in there? Ben Owen, this is Ian Malcolm. Nick's our field photographer. Ian is our... Ian. Oh, just a second. Uh, I know we've got the key somewhere. Is that it? No, that's candy. Powder. You could break it, sure. It's not like you'll have to... <laughs> Whew. It's no use. That engine ain't budgy. You got any idea how to push that in without pulling a hamstring? Oh, man. I never should have taken home the engine hoist to shift my couch. You 
ever heard of health and safety? Sheesh. Whoa! I never would have thought to do that. That's it! Keep pushing! Okay, okay, stop. She's home. Thanks. This is a high, high hide. You know, you go up and you hide. Hide. Actually, it's put up a very convenient fighting height. Someone meant to be putting a roof on the mobile lab? Or is it meant to be an open top? You know, it might rain on the island. At the very least, we should consider making it a convertible. It's only for a few days, but I wouldn't be going if it wasn't a, if it wasn't uh, really Dr. important. Dr. Malcolm. This is so cool. I built a location sensor into Dr. Harding's satellite phone, so we should be getting a reading. Sarah's, do you think, are on this island? Wow. 
This is... This is magnificent. Oh yeah, ooh, ah, that's how it always starts. But then later there's running and then screaming. are incredible, legendary. Wow. Why did you see him? It's a family group. If I can just get a shot of the nest. I'll be right back. Sarah, no, no! Just stay there. Sarah. Sarah. She's much too close. Protecting their baby. Use dirt. Who started a fire? I just wanted to make dinner. Wanted ready when you guys got back. Kelly, Kelly, you have no what idea. Did they lock her up for curiosity? Yeah. You really came Eddie? all that way in the uh -huh. I don't get it. It says engine on the on the side of that chopper. I don't get that. Why, why would Hammond send two teams?
for base camp. This is a game trail, Mr. Ludlow. If you want me to run your little camping trip, I'm in charge. Okay. Okay! Dieter, get into the outrigger. You're closing in on her. The one with the big red horn, the pompadour. Simply put, InGen is seeking limited partners to defray some of our expansion costs. You don't bring people halfway around the world to visit a zoo. You bring the zoo to them. Mr. Hammond knew this before he ever dreamt of an island. He began construction on an amphitheater. San Diego is the perfect site. It could be completed and ready to receive visitors in less than a month. We're taking these animals out of here. They're back to the mainland. Uh, I think I should tell you guys. Hammond told me these people might show up. He did send a backup plan. What backup plan? Me. It's still woozy? How much sedative did you shoot it with? <laughs> Who are you? They can't be here! Get them! Ow! <laughs>
Andrew. Trouble's brewing. What the? There shouldn't be anyone else on the island. Capture them! Learn their names, man! Let me tell you about some of the attractions we have in store for the park. For a start, we'll have a Pachycephalosaurus petting zoo. Of course, those particular dinosaurs have a habit of headbutting anything that moves. The same is true. Everyone seems to. Brachiosauruses as slides, thanks to their long necks. And as they're herbivores, they're extremely unlikely to eat any of the visitors. We think we'll lose one, perhaps two in every thousand, which is well within our safety margins. A particularly profitable money spinner will be the Triceratops Ring Toss, a variant of the fairground mainstay with the added difficulty of the competitors having to get the hoops over a moving target. I'd wager that one might say it'd be up and running. He's got a broken leg. Let's get in the car before they hear us. Out of your mind? Shh, Do you have any voice. idea what that is? Come on, open the door. You're nuts. That should make an interesting chapter in your book. Hang on to something! Hang on to something! Who's hurt? What do you need? We need three double cheeseburgers with everything. No onions on mine!
Increase your rate of climb. Communication equipment's been destroyed. Back We're off. stuck here, ladies and gentlemen, and stuck together thanks to you people. At least we came prepared. There's a communication center here, in the old operations building. If we can get here, we can send a radio call for the airlift. Swap my stun rod for Morris's dessert.
this little pest looks a lot bigger close up. That idiot bird said they weren't dangerous. Hey, Carter, where are you? We're meant to be safe, Department. Just isn't a proper campfire without s'mores. I could really go for one right about you. The operations building is right down in there. About a mile and a half from the base of these cliffs. We'll let them sleep one more hour. Oh no. Look at this. I think it's RJ's back. Go, go. Quick! Run into the tall grass! They won't be- Watch out for the helicopter! For the last time, they're called Velociraptors!
not funny. I really thought it was a raptor. Hey! Backpack through the grass. Oh no. The backpack attached to their arm. It's still attached to their arm. And their arm is attached to the rest of their body. Dude, will you shut up? I'm trying to hide here. And now the body is talking. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's tickling me. No. <laughs> For the love of everything, it's tickling me. Oh, no, not the. I thought it was going to be eaten. Like some kind of pie. Possibly. <laughs> into the long grass. This was the worst idea ever. You're telling me my hay fever is acting up a storm. Ten bucks instead. I would have shuffled off my mortal coil. Pick the bucket. Oh! Ah! Ah! Oh. They said the communication center Looking? is in the operations building. So I'll just, I'll get in there and I'll send the radio call, all right? I'll see you there. Boy, oh. Every second counts. Anyone who thinks they can keep up, welcome to try.
Here, 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 here!
School cut you from the team? More survivors? There's another chopper coming! Fifteen years ago, John Hammond had a dream. Well, half an hour from now, John Hammond's dream, reimagined, will come true. Tonight we'll christen Jurassic Park San Diego with a mega attract. The ship is here. It's early. <laughs> Can you help that? Miss Justin! You! You gotta get me out of here! That's it! Keep pulling! I'm free! Thanks, buddy! This is gonna get me a Pulitzer!
here! This is private property! There's no sign of them. It's just like the Mary Celeste. The crew of the Marie Celeste were eaten by dinosaurs too? Oh, sure, drop the anchor after they crash! Oh, gosh. Pirates! Stop them! <laughs> I don't understand where the crew got to. Oh, have we checked behind the ship for waters? Are you not the crew? mysteriously disappeared, and he was standing just above the most fearsome carnivore in the history of the world? Actually, it's... Hey! What are you doing here? Containment equipment is here. We've got to get it back to the dock. Where's the infant? It's in a secure facility. Why? Where's the facility? How will we find the adult? Follow the screams.
Yeah, the waterfront's right on the other side of these. There we go. Ready? Where's the wreck? Is it still behind us? Dr. Malcolm! What have you done with it? I want that infant! Oh, there you are. These creatures require our absence to survive, not our help. And if we could only step aside and trust in nature, life will find a way.